do you feel so overwhelmed so unhappy about your present situation in life and you just want to give up you don't want to fight anymore that was me as i lay down in my dark pit of hopelessness overwhelmed by misery and anger my frail self breaking down why where had you let all this happen he has promised to be with me always unfortunately i couldn't feel him he has promised to strengthen me if so then why was my strength leaving me daily why was i feeling so alone he has promised to, to be my comfort in my time of sorrow all i have to do is call on him and then he'll be there to comfort me but why why is it that i'm drowning in my sorrows i'm overwhelmed o oh, mortal being that i am who will help me should i bring our relationship to an end and forsake all the teachings i've learned since childhood knowing that he is my father he is my heavenly king that will always be there for me surely he will understand won't he suddenly i remembered mary of magdala the harlot who was condemned to death by the multitude they were ready to pounce on her at any moment but she met jesus her life changed when she met jesus she was forgiven instead of death she was given eternal life and forgiveness i remember the prodigal son having squandered all the wealth that he had been given he came back to his senses and decided to go back home and the father was so merciful he arranged to receive him back home he threw him a royal party to mark his return and that is our heavenly father that's how loving he is i remember nebuchadnezzar the mighty king who filled his heart with so much pride because of what he had accomplished because of his achievement but you know what friends god humbled him god humbled him for 7 years in the wilderness eating grass like a beast and when time was right god restored him to his glory i remembered the story of job faithful man of god he he lost his family he lost everything that he had but still his faith in god did not waver was this my moment of surrender was it time to surrender everything to god was it time to have a talk with jesus i decided to go back to my father to have a little talk with jesus maybe he will be able to shed some light on why things happen the way they do and yes friends he did that for me he shed some light on why some things had happened in life i told him of my worries my misery my fear my hopelessness and he was a faithful friend he was a faithful friend to me i talked with jesus like a friend and suddenly my chains were broken my chains fell down i was a free person once again so he had been there with me each day in my worries in my sorrows he had been with me by my side and ahead of me each day it's only that i was so lost in my sins i was so lost in my worries that i did not give him time but then you know what friends his time was the perfect he had a reason and he shed the light for me and made me understand why everything happens the way it does so my friends cast all your anxieties on him because he knows you he knows your every care he knows your every worry and he cares for you and he will never forsake you when you feel lost pray some more pray some more my friends he is faithful he is a faithful father who will answer you and make you bold have a little talk with jesus surrender everything to him this is your moment this is your time this is your moment of surrender so surrender